Hey, my friends, how you guys doing tonight? This is Xavier with the Thrive Business Institute and the Legendary Leadership Academy. And I'd like to welcome you guys to tonight's broadcast. Hope everyone is doing well tonight. I know you can hear me, can't quite see me yet. There we go. I'm gonna find out what's going on one of my cameras. Hope you guys are doing well tonight. Tonight is Business Building Tuesday. I'm sorry. It's Business Building Tuesday, guys, so you know exactly how tonight goes. This is about you. This is about your business. This is about the stuff you have going on inside of your business, and I'm here to help you. So tonight, all you have to do, put your questions in the chat below, and I'm going to answer them. Any business question that you got, it can be a marketing, finances, specials, you could be talking about advertising campaigns, marketing campaigns, opening a new business, closing a business, selling a business. It really doesn't matter. I'm here for you. As long as you have questions, I'm here to answer it for you. So you guys know that I don't do a whole lot of teaching on the broadcast. So in other words, what I don't do is sit here for an hour and just teach, right? I'm here to help you. So that's, that's what I want to do tonight. So all you have to do is put your questions in the chat below and, uh, and we'll get started. How you doing, Ms. Walker? Thank you for tuning in tonight. Hope all is well with you and the family. Hope your business is doing well. So guys, tell me what's going on tonight. Tell me what's going on in your businesses. What, uh, what are your successes? Like, what are you winning at, right? Where, where are you winning? So I'd love to know about that uh, tonight. So just put that in the chat. You also, uh, what you guys will see in the link of the actual video tonight is you will see an option to join the Entrepreneurial Group Coaching Program. It's a program where I actually go in and I teach. I teach every single month two main uh, topics. One is marketing. So I go into what's working in the marketplace every single month and what's current and what's, uh, you know, what's trending, so to speak. So you get that live training. And of course, you can ask any question that you want during that training. In addition, I do a business growth uh, training. It's a two-hour live training. And uh, that is, of course, their videos. You can go back and watch them as much as you want to. Any tools, worksheets, things like that that uh, are added. You guys, are, of course, you have access to those. You also have access to unlimited email support where you can email me at any time. And I respond within 24 to 48 hours with any business question. You may be having a uh, tough time making a decision on an ad campaign. Or maybe you want to run a special. Or maybe you want to introduce a new product or talk about pricing. You can do that. You just shoot me an email and and I'll, uh, whatever that question is, and I'll respond to you. So that link is right above. I'm giving you guys special pricing. It's normally $60, uh, $97 a month. You guys are getting a special. It is $67 a month now. And let me tell you, if you are the individual that's not going to utilize the information, then the program is not for you. Like if you're not going to put this stuff into action, then yeah, save your money. But if you want to grow your business, if you want to do some great things with your business, then the program is for you. If you're interested, click the link above. You'll see it. It is the Entrepreneurial Group Coaching Program. And uh, so, hey, I'm excited to offer that to you. So moving on, guys, listen, this broadcast is for you. So any business questions that you have tonight, that is why I'm here. It's Tuesday. I'm excited to be here with you and uh, talking about your business, right? talking about the stuff you guys have going on and the wins or the losses that you're having in your business. I want to I want to discuss those. I want to talk about them. You know, we're in a time of year where everyone is going back to school. So I do want to um, I want to talk about uh, talk about that kind of the specials that you guys are running in your businesses. Let's talk about that. Um, what about um, marketing campaigns moving into the fall? Right. So we are at the, the tail end of summer. Uh, you should be thinking about your fall campaigns and your next big date, right? Uh, so here in America, uh, our next major holiday is Labor Day. And so we need to be thinking about what are we doing for Labor Day, right? Like what's the, what's the, uh, you know, where, where are we there? So that is something that you guys should be, um, should be thinking about, should be thinking about. Do you guys have any specials? Do you have anything that you have scheduled or planned for Labor Day? Any um, any ways that you're going to celebrate? Any ways that your business is going to do some marketing? 
uh, for Labor Day. If you guys need some help with coming up with some sort of Labor Day campaign, just put it right there in the chat. Tell me what business you're in and uh, can definitely help you get uh, get something planned or scheduled for um, for Labor Day for Labor Day. Should be awesome. So if you do have any questions, guys, put it right there in the chat below. I know I'm a little loud, a little loud. Sorry about that. Let me turn this down just a bit. So like I said, I know that, um, we, you know, you got some stuff going on with the new um, with the new program that I'm offering. Once again, it's the Entrepreneurship Group Coaching Program. So what I do here in these videos, guys, is I come on and I give you just free coaching, right? Now, when we talk about your business, we talk about sort of the wins and the losses. We talk about um, a lot of marketing, a lot of advertising, a lot of business growth ideas. Um, the group coaching program is totally different. It's where I actually teach you. I teach you what's working. I teach you how to build the business and teach you how to expand the business. So um, again, click the link above if you are interested in that program. And I give you guys special pricing. It's a $30 discount. It is $67 versus the regular price of $97. And if you've experienced any of my teaching, you know that uh, I do this. It's not being arrogant. It is just simply confident that there is no business that I can't grow. It, uh, it just, you know, so that's that's my gift. And I want to share it with you guys. So there there you have it. So what questions do you guys have for me tonight? Sort of what, what do you have going on in your business? What is... Um, What's happening? What's the big things that you are getting ready to do, right? Like, what do you have planned? Um, like I said, the next major holiday we have is Labor Day. So we need to begin to think about, you know, marketing campaigns. Now, I will be doing a, um, so for my group coaching program on Monday, we are doing the marketing monthly um, training. So I'll be talking about uh, what is working in marketing for this month and those things should tote you into and throughout September. So uh, if you are interested in joining the program and uh, getting some in-depth training, uh, then now is the time to do that. That class or that uh, session is happening Monday the 26th and uh, this special price offer, I will probably extend it through the week and then after that, it will be that back up to its regular price. So, and that $67 a month, of course, is good for the life of your membership. Uh, so anyway, we'll be doing that training on Monday, the 26th. Guys, listen, if you have any questions, put it in the chat below. Let's talk about sort of where you guys are tonight, where you're struggling, where your business is, um, where your opportunity is. Let's talk about that tonight. Uh, thank you guys for checking in. I see all of you guys checking in. I really appreciate it. When you see me looking over, guys, I'm looking to see if there's any questions that have come up. Uh, Miss Yvonne Walker came and checked in. I really appreciate you and appreciate your support. You know, I really do. Like I said, every week I come, I don't, um, you guys know I don't pitch you often. You know, I don't try to sell you stuff often. So I just, uh, but our program is open and I think that it is the next step, the next logical step in your, uh, in your business. So, um, Let's talk about it. Yvonne, what, um, tell me what your business is. Let's, let's talk about that again. And then we'll talk about some, some, uh, some ideas, some ideas. Just tell me what industry you're in. What, uh, I, I can't remember right off. I know that you, you know, you watch the broadcast all the time. So let's talk about sort of what your, what your industry is. And, and while she's typing that and guys, forgive me as I look down, I'm just sharing this to a few, um, few other spots, you know, and guys, feel free to listen. If this broadcast is valuable to you, if your network, your friends, share this to your page, share it to your page, share it to your network. If it adds value to you, um, I have a lot of free resources right above this video that people can, uh, you know, can take and, and, um, and profit off of if they are, um, if they're interested in that. So Yvonne, just tell me what business you're in again. I forgot. Um, forgive me, but let's, let's kind of think through what, you know, what our opportunities are with really getting your business, uh, growing by utilizing specials and, uh, utilizing, uh, discounts and things like that. Cause that is the, that's the way to grow the business. There's no need of, there's no need of me lying. That's the way to, that's the way you grow it. You know, that's the way that it, it happens. And so I want to, I want to work with you talk with you about 
sort of what you have uh, what you have going on. So I'll wait for you to put that in there, and we will, uh, you know, we'll continue, we'll continue kind of doing our thing. But I think that you, you know, I think you do have some opportunity. You just gotta once again, you gotta capitalize on it. And the way that you run, you know, discounts and add-ons and specials, um, you know, it's it's a numbers game. It really is, uh, and you, you you gotta, you know, you you got you got to um, you got to be ready, right? You got to be ready, and you have to you got to play. The more people you reach with your offers, you know, if you can get a five or ten percent return on that, that is um, you're doing awesome. You know, with with that kind of return on uh, the investment, so. You need to think through that. Of course, Facebook advertising and marketing is another huge um, opportunity for any businesses. Uh, oftentimes, what we think is if we build up our Facebook page, we get a lot of people to like it, which I'm, I'm kind of against. Uh, I'm kind of against when you're building your page, all you're doing is having people go click a like, right, from your friends list. Because uh, if that's the case, there's no need to even do that. If all the people that are liking your page are friends, then why create the additional page? Just run the special on your personal page and go from there if you're just trying to build numbers, right? So the way that your uh, pages are going to continue to grow organically is through adding value to your customer base. And you can do that literally in any industry. It doesn't matter what you got. You can add uh, tremendous value to your customers. Now, as you do things like what I'm doing right now, like I'm doing this video to help you guys out and talk to you, what I can do is chop this video up, right, to small little tidbits. So let's say I'm talking to Yvonne about how to build and how to get um, more action from her page. So I would take that tidbit of information and then I would share that or make that a Facebook ad and then point people to the page. As people watch the ad, they click through, they listen to what I'm talking about, they click like on the page. Those are individuals that are interested in my body of work. If my page is full of people that are interested in my body of work, it's an easier sell than it is to just go to my friend's page, send out, ask everybody to like it. They go and they like it out of you know just being nice but those are not true customers. That's not the demographic. That's not the psychographics of the customers that we're looking for. So a lot of you guys have built your Facebook pages from your friends list. And then so you got, you know, five, six, seven hundred, eight hundred people on th that have liked your page. But 90 percent of them are your friends that have never purchased from you. And if they've never purchased from you, when you go to run your ads and you do things like lookalike campaigns, people that have liked your page, you're just going to find more people like your friends who haven't spent any money with you to like your page, which is a waste, right? So you have to have little value adding content and items that are really going to assist you to take your business to the next level. So with that being said, I just, I hope that makes sense to you guys. I hope it makes sense that, you know, just, um, just adding, you know, Asking people to like your page just to ask people to like your page is not the way to build your page. It's just, it's just not. So uh, that's awesome, awesome, Christopher. How you doing, my friend? Christopher is another frequent of the uh, of the group. Love talking to Christopher. He has a um, he has a company also that uh, does um, uh, digital and social media marketing. He offers far more stuff. Expert in his industry, but this is uh, this is one of the issues, and and of course you know you see that he has talked about it also with his following guys. It just doesn't work. It just doesn't work, and it screws up all of your numbers when it comes to um, running ads. It just it just messes you up. You know, friends are great, but you want friends that buy. Like that's <laughs> that's the people you want to like your page, or the people that buy from you. And the easiest way to get those numbers up on your page is to do ads. And when you're doing Facebook ads, and this is something that we'll talk about in my um, group coaching training, is um, Facebook ads and right and how to run those and why you run those 
And we're going to talk about that in the entrepreneurship coaching program. We'll be doing that, of course, like I said, on Monday. Um, but that is the paid program for entrepreneurs that are really trying to take their businesses to the next level. And I want you guys as entrepreneurs to understand uh, what it is and how to utilize Facebook. I work with so many people that said that they've utilized Facebook. They've utilized social media marketing. It doesn't work. I'm telling you, it does. Right. If you look at some pages, I would much rather have 300 people that have organically liked my page than I would a thousand people who were just on my friends list and, um, you know, click like just for the fun of it. So there are definitely ways to build that. And if you want to build it, the fastest way to build it is to add value, 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 value. That is the word of the day when it comes to your Facebook page, your Instagram page, anything that you got. Instagram is a tad bit different, but you can still add value in um, with Instagram. So uh, I like to work out. It doesn't look like it, but I do. And I know on Instagram, what I get a lot of is uh, everybody believes you got to, you know, you got to take these nice selfies and everything. I look at mostly uh, workout routines that are written. They're typed out. And, um, you know, it's just it's a JPEG that's put up on on Instagram. And, um, you know, so those do just as well if it is adding value, if it's something valuable to your customer base. And you can do that no matter what you're selling. Um, the, the thing is, and I wanted to, I wanted to put a, a, something out last week about it and I didn't do it. Um, guys, someone has, someone has fooled us as entrepreneurs to believe that there is one thing that you can do to expand your business and make it explode and do all of these magical things. And that's just, that's just not true. It's, it's just not um, it is, it is so far from the truth. It is, um, there's a gestation period. There is a period of growth that every business has every business. Um, and in the beginning it is, it's slow guys. It's slow. Very few businesses hit the ground and they just run, 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 um, and, and can be self-sufficient during that time. Very few. And these are the things that you need to be thinking about. Uh, I see it in the groups and I promise I'm not trying to harp on anybody's profession. I'm not trying to piss anybody off. But in business, you cannot uh, run around all day thinking that there is a magical um, person that's going to lend you money, that's going to seed and give to your business so that you can go out there and do what? And Like, I don't, I don't get it. I don't get why a lot of us entrepreneurs are still looking for someone to put thousands of dollars into your idea. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's the fastest way to go into debt. It is the fastest way to go into debt. Any infused money into your business from like a bank, a loan or anything like that is, uh, is swelling and swelling goes down. Swelling is not growth. It's temporary growth at best. And, um, and you'll swell up, it'll get really big, you'll think you're doing well, and then the swelling goes. That's what these, you know, these little infusions of, of uh, investors and, you know, people saying they can find you grants and all that kind of stuff. Guys, it's not it. It's really not. So, and I'm, like I said, I'm not trying to be mean. I'm not trying to, but, you know, as an entrepreneur, I'm just trying to give you what works. I'm not telling you some crap about, you know, what some seminar told me that there's money out there. I'm telling you as an experienced entrepreneur, I've done this for two decades. I've opened over 15 businesses. Guys, start grassroots and start slow. Master the delivery of your product or service. Master that. And when you master that, the money comes. It does. I don't know how. It just does. Now, when you begin to grow, you don't have the debt. You don't have the, you know, the, the uh, well, debt that you owe someone. If someone gives you $100,000 to open up your business, no matter what the business is, if that $100,000 is not going to make you $200,000 in six months where you can pay off the $100,000, you're in debt because your first $100,000 is not profit. It's debt. That's all it is. And it's to pay off debt. So that's not the position you want to be in. And what happens is we believe that there's a fast track. To success. Matter of fact, a lot of the programs and trainings that people give you, that's what they're trying to get you to believe that there is a fast track to success. And there's just not. There's not a fast track to growing your business. If you just open your business, and look, I can't put a timetable on it. 
Like, I, I can't tell you the first year you're not going to make any money. I'm not going to say that, right? But what I'm saying is, is that if you have the proper coaching, and that's why I created the group coaching program. That's why I create courses. Guys, there are, there are no shortcuts to success, but there are tour guides, not travel agents. There are tour guides that can circumvent a lot of the foolishness that you can get caught up in. And I see this every day when I go out to local businesses, we'll talk about marketing and those businesses will go out and they will invest thousands of dollars into individuals, into programs, into little things that don't work. They don't. And then when I sit down and talk to them and ask them some very foundational questions about their business, can you deliver your product or service correctly? Yes or no? Um, are you doing it, you know, nine times out of 10, are you hitting, are you getting a 10? Are you satisfying your customers? Do your customers like what you're offering? Is your price point correct? Um, are your customers happy, right? Those are all the things that dictate if your business will be a success, right? Is there a good profit margin in whatever it is that you're doing? Um, I remember I tested out a, um, and I do this from time to time. I tested out a, uh, a, a tree cutting venture and, um, you know, got the equipment, went out, cut a few trees down. I think I, you know, I don't know, probably seven, eight trees. No, it was more than that. It was some big trees in the backyard. And then we cut down some smaller trees on the side. And I forget what we charged. It was like 300 bucks. I mean, it was cheap. It was really cheap. And what I saw was, is that not only would it require more specialized help, right? Because these were little trees and we could fell a tree. And I, I literally learned on YouTube how to make a tree fall where you want it to fall and how to cut it. Like all of that stuff was great. But at the end of the day, when I looked at the numbers, it just isn't, it didn't, it didn't work for me. It didn't work for me. The training had to be too specialized. Um, and, you know, I don't want to start a business that I can't hire somebody and train them within a week to run it. Like that's, that's just the way that I do business. That's the way that I, you know, I look at entrepreneurship. If I am the guy that has to make it, make the wheels turn, then it's probably not going to be a good business venture for me. Uh, I have a lot of, you know, folks that open up uh, a job for themselves. Like that's essentially what they do. They say, I'm an entrepreneur, but you have to be there every day. And if you have to be there, you, you, you don't have a, you don't have anything that, that's, that can grow. Right. If you're the only person that can make that magic happen, you got to you, you got to have a program that can that is um, that can turn and churn other individuals through it. If you think about McDonald's, one of the more successful restaurants in history, whether you like the food or not, it doesn't matter. Um, they've developed a process in the way they operate their businesses. And so. When, they, when McDonald's opens up, I mean, they'll have, you know, some corporate folks that will come in for a week or two to give some support, to do some training. After that, dude, it's teenagers and college kids running McDonald's. You know, you don't need a whole lot of education um, to run a McDonald's. You know, it's just, it's, you know, they got an operations manual and they give you the operations manual. If the system goes down, flip to page so-and-so in the operations manual. If a customer, you know, is yelling and screaming at the front counter, you know, the operations manual tells you exactly how to handle that. This is how you make a Big Mac. This is how you make, you know, it's really, really simple. Well, they can literally hire just about anybody to do it. So when you're thinking about your business, uh, first, if you haven't documented the things that you need to grow the business, right? Like whatever your main product or service is, how do you do it every day, right? If you have an online business, if people are going to your website, what happens? How do you manage the site? How do you fulfill an order? Um, how do you deposit the money? Uh, how, do you, how do you do a refund? Little things like that are important because if you don't have this stuff documented, you don't have a business. You really don't. So these are just things that I want you guys to think about as you think about your business and growing your business and really making that thing, you know, do what it's supposed to do. Um, you know, so... But if you guys do have questions, my friends, listen, I'm here for you. Let's talk. Let's talk about what uh, what you guys are struggling with tonight. If you do have any questions, welcome to everyone that has tuned in. I appreciate you. 
Uh, this broadcast is for you. This broadcast is literally for individuals that have businesses that want to, um, that need some help, you know? So that's what I'm here to do. I'm here to help you. And if I can, that's what I do. So, but you got to put the question in the chat. You got to ask me, you know, you got to ask a question. You can't just uh, listen to me teach. You know, as I tell you guys often every single week, I enjoy, um, I enjoy serving you guys. I enjoy helping you with your businesses and enjoy, um, you know, enjoy everything you guys got going on. So uh, vertical jump training, uh, I don't know what that is. Clickbank. Yeah, so we're not going to do that one. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what that is. So um, disregard. But um, but like I said, I'm here for you guys. Let me know what uh, what I can do for you. How can I help you tonight? How can I help you grow your business tonight? I am so interested in helping you do that. That's where I get, uh, you know, that's where I get my superpower. Helping you grow your business is... Um, it's how I, it's how I do me. All right. So tell me exactly what you guys are going through tonight. Tell me how I can help you. How can I help you grow your business? Because I am here to do it. I'm here to help grow. So put your question right there in the chat. I don't know what that comment was. I'm going to erase it if I can't, uh, if I can't really figure it out. So how can I help you guys tonight? Oh, Yvonne, I'm sorry. This did not come up. I see all this stuff going. I'm sorry, Yvonne. Massage therapy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your, your message didn't come through. So let's... Um, if you're still on, Yvonne, let me, let me know. Yeah, if you're still on, let me know. And um, yeah, if you're still with us, Yvonne, let me know. Massage therapy. How you doing, George? Hey, my friend. Okay. All right. Sorry about that. I don't know what what was going on with my. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, I see it now. Okay, so massage therapy. So let's talk about, um, let's pull your website up. Um, can you put your website back in the link? Let's look at that again. Um, have you ran any specials, any Facebook stuff? Any, um, have you done any of that stuff here recently? Um, Instagram campaigns, anything like that? Well, let me put my glasses back on. Oh, I see all this stuff over here now. Pre-sale a book on Amazon. Okay. Absolutely, George. I can give you some info with that, my friend. Um, so, your, Yvonne, one of the things you got to think through is massage. So, and I'm getting ready to open my course. I promise I am. It's uh, massagetherapymasterclass.com. Um, the link is not active yet. I don't think. Um, yes, yeah, back to school, Facebook. Okay, okay. Uh, massage therapy. Jesus. Masterclass. Um, so still working on my site. It's not up yet. So, but I will, I'm going to write your name down so I can keep you, keep you in the loop. I think that the program is going to really do well for you. Um, but anyway, I'll send you that info. So Yvonne, so talk to me about, give me, um, 
Let's see. You do... Let me go to your page. Renew. Renew Massage Therapy. Yep, I remember it. All right, so what I'm going to do, let's see, let me make sure first. Let's see, I think you have your website on here. You do. So I'm going to show you some stuff. Let's pull up your page. And uh, we're going to pull up your page, um, Yvonne, your website. And... Uh, All right, so first, here is your uh, Renew page. And of course, it's clean, it's nice, you know, no, no, you know, nothing bad. Um, it looks, it looks good. However, what you can do on your page, and I don't know if you knew or not, but you can do a schedule appointment uh, button right to your page and um yeah if you do that you 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 you're going to be in a good a good spot that's a you're being a, you're being a good spot you just you give people make it easy for people to schedule an appointment with you um okay well I just messed that up with my big head all right I'll get off the screen. There we go. So you can add a um, you can add an appointment. You just go into your settings, and it would show up right in here. Yeah, it show up right in here, right in the, this area, the shop now area. You have a thousand people that have liked your page. Now this is. This is what's going to go into your. Um, this is what's going into um, what I talked about earlier. These thousand people that have liked your page, or chances are, are friends and family, people on your Facebook page that you've had go over and uh, and and like your page. And so, the like I said, the problem that you're going to run into now is when you go to run Facebook ads, these folks is going to be the, that's going to be the target. And if these people are not the people that are buying your stuff, you're going to constantly be sending ads to people that are not interested and that are not the greatest potentials to be buyers. So you want to make sure that you, um, you know, that, that they can, you know, that they, they, the people that are liking your page are people that you're adding some, some real value to. And, uh, you can, you can definitely do that. Uh, I don't think that you're going to have a, have a big issue with it. You just, um, you got to create some content. All right. So here we go next. So the first thing on your page is here. These are your hours and basic info, right? But what you need to pin, and I see you have it pinned up at the top of the page, what you need pinned up here is something that's going to add some real value to your customers, okay? It could be um, a free video that you have that talks about, um, and you could just literally look at your camera. Like you can literally just go to your, um, go to your Facebook or go to your, your phone and you know, pull out your camera and just kind of do your thing, you know, without, so let's, let's see. So you can literally take your phone and say, hey guys, you know, this is Yvonne uh, with Renew Massage Therapy. And did you guys know that, you know, massage therapy, um, you know, decreases uh, or increases the natural killer cells in AIDS and cancer patients. Did you guys also know that massage therapy increases blood circulation and lowers diastolic blood pressure? All of these are research studies that, and, and you can go into it, you know, in more detail. 
Um, guys, I can help you with a variety of ailments and issues that you're dealing with on a daily basis. Hey, schedule your appointment right down below. If I can help you with anything, give us a call. Really simple, right? So maybe five, 10 minutes of you going through some value adding stuff, right? That needs to be at the very top of your page, okay? That needs to be at the top of your page so that you know, or so that when your customers go to your page, they are really getting some, you know, some great value into your site, okay? So that's the first thing I would switch up here is that, okay? So something that's a value add. Now, you can make this also a link to a uh, an opt-in. Right. So where you're building your newsletter and things like that. So you can make it that, um, you know, you just you just got to chew on it and kind of think, uh, you know, think through it. And however you want to however you want to operate, operate that. OK, so. I mean, switch screens really quick. All right. So first things first, you need to switch to the Facebook page template that has appointments where you can schedule an appointment and all you're going to do, all it is, this button will say appointment. This button will be appointment, the shop now button. Um, and then, you know, it'll say appointment or schedule an appointment and then it'll go over to um, whatever you have on your website. Okay. So that is your Facebook page. Everything else looks good. You know, it's basic info every day. Give a quick pointer or two about, uh, the, you know, the benefits of massage therapy. It's, and you can, like, you can do it. I would use something like, um, uh, let's see. Massage therapy foundation. I think it's dot org. So I would use this website. Let me put it in the chat. And put that in the chat. And, um, and every day have a post that talks about, you know, something, just something in massage therapy. Okay. Just anything, anything in massage therapy. So keep that in mind now. And then of course people can share that, uh, stress what burnout is and how to deal with it. Now watch this. This is an image, but it doesn't add any value to me. What burnout is and how to deal with it like it's it doesn't so you can make you can you can utilize this and talk about you know what what massage therapy is and how massage therapy can assist or what stress is and how stress burns the body out right so you can talk about all of those things and um so it, it's got to be something with value it can't just be a you know just a uh um you know, come get a massage. It can't be that because it doesn't have value. If that's the way that you're marketing massage therapy right now, that's one of the reasons why nobody's responding because it's not a necessity. It's seen as a luxury and people only spend the surplus on luxuries for the most part, right? So you have to be able to cultivate it and, and word it in a manner that speaks to what they're going through right then. Right. So talk about stress, talk about backaches, talk about headaches, talk about um, uh, shoulder pains, talk about working out, talk about the importance of staying limber and uh, how massage therapy can assist with the rehabilitation of injuries and things like that. You got to talk about and meet people where they are and let them see the connection where massage therapy is the answer to whatever it is that they're going through. So I hope that that I hope that that makes uh, makes sense. So let's look over at your website. Yvonne, I hope that this is adding value to you. George, I have not forgot about you, my friend. I'll be with you in a second. And guys, anybody else, if you guys are tuned in, if you have any questions, put it right there in the chat and, uh, and you'll be up next. 
So this is great. Now, this is some more stuff that I'm going to talk about in my uh, in the massage therapy masterclass um, training. So, as therapists, and I want to I want you to look at me when I look at me when I'm talking to you. I want you to look at me when we're talking about this. And I'm, let me get my camera up because I want you I want you to understand my heart when I'm talking to you about this. Listen. When you have a website and people come to your website, hear my heart, they don't care anything about the stuff that you have on your front page. They don't. They don't care anything about it. I promise you that. Because if I have a migraine, if I am stressed, if I am, you know, having some sort of pain or ailment, I care about that. So you need to begin to think like a customer and not like a therapist. You get what I'm saying? Um, if you have the potential, if you have the option on your page, on your website, let's go back to it, to add a video. Like I would much rather all of this, all of this stuff here, be a video. And it'd be a video of you Literally, you know, standing by your massage table, standing near it to, hey guys, my name is Yvonne. I really appreciate you visiting my site. Listen, I know that if you're here, I know that you, you know, there's some things that you may be struggling with, right? You may have some, some back aches. You may be struggling with some sort of ailment. And I want to let you know that I'm here to help you. I'm here to be, um, you know, everything that you need me to be for you, you know, in the medicinal uh, process, right? And you talk through, you talk through that with your customer base. And I'm telling you, that's that's the way you you make your customers feel you know, like like you care. Right? Like that's the way you make them feel important. They feel valued when those, you know, when you're speaking that kind of language uh to them. And so, you know, just just keep it in mind as you as you continue to move forward. Keep that in mind that that's, you know, that's what's really going to going to make your customers feel, you know, what they need to, to feel in order to be comfortable with you. Uh, it's kind of cliche ish, but it is real in every business. We do business with people that we know, like and trust. And so when they come on your page, what um, you know, what can you what how can you get them to like you? And you can do that, you know. Uh, this right here is very generic. You know, welcome to my website. Looking for a professional massage therapist. You've come to the right place. You're only speaking to people that are familiar with massage. That's it. Um, in a good or a bad way. You get what I'm saying? I'm trained in a variety of modalities. Your customers don't know what the hell that is. Right? They don't like they don't know. I mean, ask if you don't believe me, ask your <laughs> Ask your Facebook page. Someone said, oh, you can't be a massage therapist to respond. What is modality? Right? Um, and see what people say. You can click on the services and rates page to learn more about the various techniques I use in my work. So thanks for visiting. Have a great day. Uh, these folks here, they put me out of one of their meetings here in Georgia because I chewed them out back in the day. Um, so anyway, I'll talk about that in the, in the training. Um, this right here will be the same link. You just take the copy of this link. And when you go to your Facebook page and you change this, uh, this button here, when you change it to, um, you know, like massage therapy and they'll give you an appointment setting, this will go to appointment set. And then you just put that link right there, uh, in Facebook. So I want you to think about this, um, I want you to think about it. Who hosts this? I know these guys. No, nope, this is AMTA. AMTA members. This looks so familiar. This platform looks so familiar. Uh, there's a company. My website is still up from my, um, my massage therapy business. Uh, one of them. Uh, Medimassage.org. And... Like I said, it kind of looked the same. 
um, with uh, with that little control panel down there. That's why I was asking, like, who who does that? Who does that? Because I, I know the company. Uh, I was one of their guinea pigs back in the day. So anyway, with all that being said, Yvonne, I hope that you kind of hear my heart as I'm talking to you about your website and s selling something like massage therapy. Massage therapy is so far a past modalities and the stuff that you'll use. Um, your, your typical customers, and this is, and listen, I don't fault you. I don't fault you at all because... Um, this is what, you know, massage therapists were taught in school. This is, you know, this is what it is. But I'm telling you, it doesn't work in the real world. It just, it doesn't. Um, and I'll give you an example. Right here that we're looking at, the chair massage, deep tissue, Swedish. So let's start right here. If I were you, I would be looking for any office building that has either multi-floors or multi-offices in it. And I would go in and set up a contract and uh, either with the building or set up contract with the various offices and let people do a membership program for just chair massage, right? It's a $20 a month, $30 a month membership, and they can come and get a massage. You're there two days a week and they can just come and get, you know, come and get a massage from you, right? It's really, really simple. Um, that's how you can make money with chairs. I mean, if you have a chair, you can literally make a, a lot of money with just chair massage. Like you don't have to do anything else. Uh, you can just do chair. People keep their clothes on. You can go. You're mobile. It's, it's really a great way to make some money. So anyway, what I was going to tell you about is when you get into deep tissue, Swedish pregnancy, neuromuscular, myofascial release, this is the equivalent of you going to a auto mechanic shop and the person wants their oil changed. And then the mechanic says, well, do you want us to use the hydraulic lift or do you want us to use the standard lift? Do you want us to use air tools or an air ratchet or would you like us to use a hand ratchet? Uh, would you like us to use a oil pan or would you like us to use a milk jug to catch the, the, the oil? That's, that's the equivalent. That's the language you're speaking. If you're the customer going to get your oil changed, you don't care what tools they use. What you care about is the oil change. And what you have listed on your site are the tools. So you need to think about who you want to work on. What do you want to focus on? And you don't have to just pick one thing. You can pick multiple things. Let's say you wanted to work with individuals with high blood pressure, okay? You're, you're, you're doing a, a special promotion for folks that suffer with high blood pressure. All the research is there that massage therapy assists with high blood pressure. And what are you going to use with high blood pressure? You're just going to use Swedish. That's it. You're just using Swedish. That's all you're using. And, um, you know, and that's the way it goes. Like, that's the way it goes. So it is a, um, and I hope that that makes sense, right? That you're focusing on the ailment, not on the tool. Your customers don't care about the tool. They care about you fixing the ailment. And so begin to change your language to speak to the ailment and not the tool. Okay? Yvonne, I'm giving you all of the good stuff. This is, this is you know, hundreds of dollars worth of stuff that will be in the massage therapy um, uh, master class. So I'm just letting you know, like, this is the stuff that they'll be getting. So uh, just understand right understand what you're getting all right here we go so same thing with you know neuromuscular therapy myofascial release you know those things people don't don't care about right if myofascial release is a form of soft tissue therapy that intended to eliminate pain increase range of motion rebalance the entire body it does this and so and like again like people don't care you know and and, and i'm telling you it's not your fault it's really not because i did when i said I did the exact same thing i did the exact same thing. Um, and I learned quickly that people don't care. Yeah, I learned quickly that people don't care. Um, what people care about is their stuff. And their stuff is what matters. Their stuff is, is the only thing that matters. And when you make a patient think about what tool you should be using, you lose them. It's that simple. It's that simple. So you, now let me say this, you have done more than most 
So I congratulate you with that. Um, but this is the reason I'm starting the Massage Therapy Masterclass. Because, you know, massage therapy has always been a passion for me. And therapists, hundreds of thousands of therapists are, are just doing it wrong, right? And our instructors made us believe that, you know, I don't put my hands on a client, you know, for anything less than $75 an hour. Well, yeah, yeah, you do one massage a week. If you want to do more than one massage a week, then you, you need to, you know, you need to do something different, right? So that's the idea. Like that's the, and that's what I want to help massage therapists do. I believe that the, we do a disservice to humanity if we're not educating humanity that we can help, but they don't, they just don't care about what the tools we use. We just got to be there to, uh, to do the help. So I am looking forward, as I say, Yvonne, that is um, going to be released uh, very, very soon. There is going to be a five-week training masterclass as well as a monthly coaching program, a business coaching program. So uh, just for massage therapy. So thanks everybody else for checking in tonight. I, uh, like I said, this is Business Building Tuesday. I'm Xavier Johnson, and I'd like to welcome you to the broadcast. I, um, I'm going to jump over to my friend, Mr. Anthony. George Anthony, Big G. All right, so uh, George, you asked about uh, pre-sale. How would you pre-sale a book on Amazon? So th the same thing that I just talked to Yvonne about is the same way that you do the book. The way that you do the book is you, or this is the way I would do it. If I was gonna, gonna do a book, I'm gonna write the first chapter, okay? Go ahead and write the first chapter because people will pay if they get something immediately, right? So I'd get the first chapter done. You don't need a book cover. You don't need any of that. All you need is the first chapter. You do the first chapter. You do a video talking about the first chapter, maybe even a, a, a coaching video, maybe even a video just kind of going into more detail of the first chapter. And then you give them the book will be delivered by, you know, a specific date. So, hey, guys, I'm, you know, and, and what it would sound like is this. Hey, guys, my name is Big G, George Anthony, and I have, you know, this book coming out here in the next um, in the next two months. But listen, because you're one of my, you know, one of my uh, followers, you're one of my students, you're you're you like my body of work. I have a special offer for you today. I'm doing a pre-sale of the book. Now, what you're going to get is. Uh, the first chapter of the book, and you're going to get a free coaching training uh, from me. Now, this book is going to assist you with doing ABC, like whatever ABC is. Those have to be like deliverables. Those got to be the things that, you know, these are the things that I want in my life, right? ABC. Um, and the book is going to deliver you that and so much more. Be sure to put that in there and so much more. I want to give you the opportunity to take advantage of this pre-sale. It's only $19.95. You go ahead and process your order right below. You're gonna get the first chapter immediately, just so you can get excited, you can see, and then you can also give me some feedback. Maybe there's some things that I missed, and uh, but I wanna serve you in the best way that I can. Go ahead and click the link below. Is $19.95 too much to invest so that you can do, and then you go back to those deliverables again, ABC. So just click the link below, go ahead and place your pre-order. Uh, and you know what? For every pre-order, I'll autograph the book for you. Guys, if I could be of any assistance to you, be sure to reach out to me at, you know, Big G at BigG.com. Thanks so much. And then the video ends and it's done, right? And then they click the link. They get the free download of the first chapter because they have something now in their hand, right? It's tangible. Um, that they can that they can move forward with and kind of do whatever it is. And then, you know, after that, you can do conference calls. You can do a whole lot of stuff to let your customers write the book for you. Like it's a whole lot that you can you can do with that, my friend. So that is um, that's some, some stuff that you need to need to think about. Did that answer the question, Anthony? Does, I mean, does that help? Just let me know. You know, I, I just I want to make sure, of course, you know, I want to add value to you. But I want to make sure that it, that it makes sense. I want to make sure that it makes sense. And it's, um, I'm going back to my page just to make sure I'm not missing any comments. So 
But that's the way. That's the way you do that, George. That's the, you know you get that get that first um, get that first book or get that first chapter written, and then give that chapter away. Give it away when they do the pre order, the nineteen ninety five, and uh, and then go from there. Give an estimated time frame um, that you're going to be able to do the book, and go from there. Um, there is a large push in the book writing industry right now that is called um, the free plus shipping. Free plus shipping. And uh, let's go to the whiteboard. Let's go to the whiteboard and uh, see if we can, we can work a little bit. Mm. All right. So the free plus shipping... Plus shipping. You'll see it. You'll see it all over the place. Everybody is doing it now. And what it essentially is, are uh, is a person has written a book, and they know that the per you know that most people I don't say most they don't want to pay that. They don't want to pay the nineteen ninety five, right? But they will pay seven ninety nine for shipping and handling. Now, if I'm looking at $7.99, let's say $8, um, out of that, you probably have to pay $1.50 to $2 for your book, right? Minus $2. Uh, so we're at $5.99. And then maybe another dollar or two in shipping. So let's say another $2 in shipping. And so now we're at $2.99, right? We're at $2.99, and you're making $3 a book. And what people are doing is they're looking at that $3 a book because if I can sell $100,000, right, at $3 a book, I'm sitting at $300,000. If I can sell $100,000 plus, I'm on the New York Times bestseller list, and what they're doing with books now, uh, Big G, is this. Most people are not just selling books. They're doing programs. So if you've made, if you sold 100,000 books, they have some kind of program that goes along with the book, right? So it's an online program or it's mentoring. The online program mentoring, they'll do... Um, um, seminars, and so the online program is now, let's say it's a $99 program, one-time fee, right? Let's say you get 25% of the book buyers to buy into your online program, which now your book serves as a textbook for the program. So now 25% of that is 25,000 people and at $100, so I've made $25,000 in the online program. Then you have a few more folks jump into the mentoring, which jumps up to 199, right? For your mentoring program, let's say half of that goes for the mentoring program. That's another $25,000. Okay, and then the seminar, you can do a one ninety nine to two ninety nine seminar, and if you get another twenty five percent, so you've essentially with a hundred thousand books, with the free plus shipping, you've made three hundred thousand dollars. You sold a hundred thousand books. You got um, the online program, twenty five percent jumped on it, so it's another twenty five. So now we're at three twenty five. Half of that jumped on the 199 mentoring. That's another 25. Boom. So now we're at 350,000. And then let's say we get, you know, I don't know, 100 people to jump on this at $300. Uh, you're looking at um, $30,000, right? So you're roughly at, you know, $400,000 with a free plus shipping. But you got to have your grid laid out for everything else that you want to do, not just the book. 
but you got an online program that goes deeper into the book. You have a mentoring program that, you know, drums down and then you, you know, you get the people to sign up for the mentoring. Um, and then the seminars, you know, you go live on it. So I hope that that, you know, kind of gives some perspective on, on what you should and, you know, should be doing with the program, Big G. So that's how I would do it. As I said, if not, you can sell the pre, do a pre-sale. I would write the first chapter though, just so people have some faith in you, some faith in the product. And, uh, you know, whatever your price point is, I would go ahead and sell it at that and, um, and go from there. I hope that helped. Hope that helped. Thank you guys for tuning in tonight. You know, I love to serve you guys. Love to help. Always here for you. How you doing, Miss uh, Cassandra Logan? Thank you for checking in tonight. Of course, Christopher checked in tonight. Really appreciate you guys. Really appreciate your support. Love to assist. Love to help you guys and give you uh, DeAndre White. Thank you, my friend. If you are uh, still watching, you guys are awesome. Mr. Kendall Jackson, appreciate it. Samid, thank you for checking in, my friend. You guys are awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Like I said, guys, you know, one of the ways that you can help me is just share. Just share the page. That's it. You see the broadcast? Share the broadcast. You see the page? Share the page. That's it. That's it. If you believe that these tools that are up above can assist somebody, go right ahead. What I also talked about earlier in this evening, guys, is the Entrepreneurial Group Coaching Program. It is uh, live. The link is in the description. It, it, this is the special pricing of $67 a month. This is where you get the business growth coaching, which some of you guys uh, took advantage of that free uh, webinar that I did for you. That was a three and a half hour training about how to grow your customers, uh, how to grow your customer base, where to go find customers. And then uh, we had some great Q&A afterwards with some actionable uh, items that they had to jump on and, uh, and do. Uh, this Wednesday is when we're moving into the monthly coaching program. Now, of course, that is for uh, paid members. So that's what we'll be recording on Monday the 26th, doing our monthly uh, coaching, I mean, monthly uh, mentoring, um, marketing monthly, grief, um, for, uh, for you guys. And that's where we'll be talking about the marketing stuff that's happening uh, currently and things that you can be doing kind of moving moving forward. So it's always, uh, always a pleasure. And these are things, of course, that, that you guys have asked for, right? So, you know, a lot of my uh, students ask, you know, how, how, how can we work with your father? How can we, you know, we need more, we need more instruction, we need more. And uh, the group coaching program is that uh, we're getting ready to uh, start again with the uh, marketing mastery 2.0. So that it will be launching in the next, uh, next month or so. And then, of course, with um, um, the group coaching program there. And uh, we're just rocking on, man. We're just rocking on. So hope that you guys are enjoying all of this, uh, all this training. So if you do have any questions, guys, go ahead and put it in the chat below. We're coming out an hour now, a little over an hour. You guys are awesome. Had some great questions tonight. Great questions. Always here to serve you. Always love to serve you guys. I think that you're doing awesome. And, um, you know, reach out to me. Uh, as you guys know, you know, I'm a practitioner of everything that I'm teaching you. So I still run my own companies. I still get up and I have to do marketing and I have to do advertising and I have to do customer acquisition and get new customers. I have to do the same things you guys are, you guys have to do. I don't sit around and, you know, just find new stuff to teach you. I'm a practitioner, right? Like I still learn every day myself and I still, you know, go out there and I run ad campaigns and sometimes the ad campaign takes off. Other times it doesn't, you know, some businesses I'll shut down because the profit margin isn't there. Um, you know, it just, it just happens guys. So I want you to know that, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm in the, I'm in it with you. I'm in it with you. So don't never, never think that, um, that I don't understand sort of where you are, what you got going on. Um, because I'm, I'm literally right there in the trenches, uh, making these things happen along with you guys. Let me put my glasses back on. You guys see, I got some glasses now. I don't have to squinch. Um, yes, 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 Charles. Yes, I am a serial entrepreneur. 
Uh, I think that's the only way you can become a, a teacher of the game is you have to be a student. You got to be a student of it. You got to take a risk. Guys, I learned um, a while back that I don't want to leave this earth without gambling on me. I've gambled on companies. I've given companies my time, my energy, my intelligence, my sweat. Um, I've sacrificed time with my children. You know, I had a failed marriage behind, you know, just trying to chase um chase the dream you know I, was a, I told you guys I was a college president you know I was a regional uh, vice president I traveled three weeks a month um, it was it was horrible you know I was going a week at a time left on Monday came back on Friday evening and because I was running 10 colleges it, you know I still had work to do when I got home I mean it, it was horrible it was it was just horrible I made great money you know, seven hundred and fifty thousand dollar home sitting on three acres of land, enclosed pool. I mean, it, I, mean I lived the life. I lived the life, guys. And it's not bragging; it's letting you know that. And and for my spiritual folk, if you're not a Christian, that's fine. I'm okay with that. No offense intended. But the Bible talks about what profit a man gain the whole world and lose his soul. You know, I had my name on a door. I had a great salary and a great bonus structure, but I didn't have freedom. And at the end of the day, guys, that's you know, I've never seen a U-Haul behind a hearse. You just won't. And so I wanted to be able to enjoy my life. And, and true freedom to me is being able to go to my kid's wrestling match, to go to my, you know, something my daughter has going on. Or, you know, I, I mean, I, you know, I got five kids, man. So uh, three are out of the house and, and living life. And uh, no, two are out of the house. Yeah, two, two out of the house. But um, I got one going to the Marine Corps next year. And you know, and uh, one going to uh, college and one in middle school. So, you know, we'll be, you know, that's where I am. So, but that's why I became an entrepreneur so that I can live life so that I can, I can be there um, because at the end of life, I didn't want my kids saying "Dad, you know, you gave us a great life, but you weren't, you weren't there. Right. Like, I didn't want that. Who wants that? I, like, I don't want that to say, yeah, I went and got my money. Yeah, you got your money, but somebody else raised your kids. And I didn't, I didn't want that. So I made the sacrifices that I needed to make to be an entrepreneur. And now I give that stuff to you guys. Not that there is a shortcut to success, but there is a, there is another route. You're still going to have to do the work. You just will not get around doing the work. You got to do the work. But as you do the work, guys, there are some things that you don't have to go through. Example, with Facebook ads. Right. In the entrepreneurial coaching program, we're going to talk about Facebook ads and how to make them successful. Right. So you don't waste thousands of dollars. We're going to talk about if you're going to advertise in a local newspaper, how to do that. Right. So you don't be like me and run an ad at four hundred dollars a week for 13 weeks. I'm telling you, I've, I've, I've blown I've blown some money on business and uh I want you guys to learn from that, okay? So it doesn't like any other questions are coming in. You guys are great. I can sit here and do this all night, and you guys know it. So uh, between now and then, guys, I want you to have a great week. If I can help you in any way, definitely let me know. The link is right up above for the Entrepreneurial uh, Group Coaching Program. Like I said, I will keep it up for a few days. Uh, this is the $67 a month program. Uh, where we get uh, in depth. Those that were on the training, you know how deep we got in that training. And it's stuff that I don't give here. If you think I give information here, guys, I, like we, we, we go deep. We go deep once we, uh, once we, you know, are in the training. So, and, and it's only fair. It's only fair, you know, to give your students the, the best of you. And that's what I, uh, that's what I, that's what I attempt to do. That's what I attempt to do every single week. So that is, um, that's where we are. That's where we are. All right. In the meantime, guys, if I can be of any assistance, definitely let me know. Have a great week. If I can help you, um, just, just shoot me a message or something and we'll, we'll go from there. In between time, have a great evening and take care.